Welcome to motivation at hand. To know is to know how. Make your foot the foot that counts. From Pentagon steps to WikiLeaks light. Ellsberg and Assange, in freedom's fight. Two men dared challenge the veil of state. Believe the public's right outweighed their fate. The resolution of Julian Assange's case on June 26, 2024. By Judge Ramona Manglona in Saipan Northern Mariana Islands. Marks a significant evolution from Daniel Ellsberg's Pentagon Papers case. Julian Assange is fundamentally a publisher, not a spy, who exposed information that embarrassed the U.S. government. His prosecution raises serious concerns about press freedom and sets a dangerous precedent for journalistic activities that challenge those in power. This progression reveals the changing landscape of whistleblowing, journalism, and state secrecy in a globalized, digital world. Unlike Ellsberg, a U.S. citizen who leaked classified documents while in the United States, Assange, an Australian citizen who operated WikiLeaks from various locations outside the U.S., including the U.K. and Ecuador's London Embassy. This key difference expands the reach and implications of whistleblowing and press freedom beyond U.S. borders, affecting journalists worldwide. Assange's case challenges these notions on an international scale by publishing classified U.S. documents from abroad. Assange's actions raised complex questions about jurisdiction, extraterritorial, application of U.S. laws, and the global nature of digital journalism. Assange's method of publishing online not only challenged traditional notions of journalism but also sparked that it's about responsible reporting, source protection, and the potential global consequences of information release. The WikiLeaks platform took whistleblowing to a new level by mass releasing classified documents online, accessible to anyone worldwide. Ellsberg's leak established crucial precedents for whistleblower protections and press freedom under the First Amendment within the U.S. legal framework. This contrasts with Ellsberg's targeted leak to specific U.S. newspapers. The global nature of Assange's case is evident in the Australian diplomatic involvement effectively impacted its resolution. Reported by ABC Investigations reporter Steve Kinane, a pivotal meeting at the U.S. Department of Justice, described by participants as robust, respectful, and at times aggressive, showcased the shifting international dynamics. Australian Senator Peter Wish Wilson, noted that U.S. officials were blindsided by the delegation, unaware of the political changes in Australia and the growing public support for Assange's return. This case has far-reaching implications for journalists across the world, not just those in the U.S. The stress between journalism and state actors now extends beyond national boundaries, forcing a re-evaluation of international law diplomatic relations, and cross-border enforcement of secrecy laws. Assange's case underscores the a global conversation on balancing government transparency, national security, and press freedom in an era where information can be instantly disseminated worldwide. First Amendment's reach, tested near and far. The people's need to know, a high bar as truth and power clash in extreme schemes. Beyond paper trails, now digital streams. Much appreciation to you for giving of your time with us at Motivation at Hand. To know is to know how. We trust you will come back soon.